Hello guys, it's the president and welcome to the last episode of Hearts of Iron 4 Zidali. Um I lost some footage, just a little bit, in which uh, I had basically the stalemate. Not really important, basically uh, I want to film the last episode because it's 1947 and nothing can be really done at this point. We already finished all our research and the game is now really slow, it's really buggy and it's really annoying. And the AI doesn't know what to do with this amount of divisions. So me derp any moment, and it's nobody's fault. I create a fallback line here because I'm not able to contain this pocket with the Chinese troops just constantly attacking, leaving the front lines and allowing everybody to just... Uh, to allies to take even more land. I'm just gonna go here because it's safer. And also I'm just gonna create a huge front line around the Indochina and just wait for what happens. When this pocket dies, uh, the Chinese troops can come here and help me. I left everything on garnison because if they can't protect against that, I don't really care, okay? The last episode, whatever. I just wanna see some fireworks. Because it's impossible for me to win at this point. It's impossible for the allies to win at this point also. It's important to note that. What can I do? See, there's really nothing that's left to research. My focus tree is done for a long time at this point. A very long time. Oh, and I will need some planes here. Airbase. Yeah, right here. I need a lot because I'll have to put all my air force in here to just waste the allies as much as possible. And I'm fully aware that even if I waste them as much as possible, as I said, it's still... still will not grant me victory at this point. The game right now is not about who wins, it's about to who stabilizes their territory. And I want to do that. I want to create a stable empire, not just a huge pile of land like a conquered Indian boom and is mine. Yeah, not really. It's really not like that. And then I will maybe try to push it. No promise at all. What are you trying to do? You're trying to do any of these? Yeah, they, they were. So what are you doing now if you have no orders whatsoever? So dumb. Okay, wait. I'll delete this whole thing. You still have something to do? What do you mean? What are you defending? Are you defending this? Yeah, he was. Defending something else, maybe? It does show me like he has an action to do. But I can't see the action. Huh, silly. Again, it's all silly. It's too late to play this game. Okay. No options anymore. This is your front line. And this will be your attack plan. Do as you're supposed to. And you also do as you're supposed to. No, actually you don't. Okay, they're falling back nicely. The Chinese are dying. I'll be dying here there too. I just want more equipment is preferable over just dying in the jungle for no reason. No, it's planes, whatever. I just instilled a little bit of the Indian jungle that's not here. This place is jungle, isn't it? It's forest, so it's not technically a jungle, but jungle is here? Hmm. Complicated. Okay, so I am currently holding nice line nicely. I sunk another ship. I am sinking their navy. No problem. Look at that. This is a huge victory. And the Germany are creating an even bigger one. So the naval race is turning in our favor for a very long time now. But it's going to be too late for any invasions. 
here we're losing a necessary amount of men. This had to be done so that I can push. And now, and now, having just one line, move into this. Why aren't you? Oh, that's why. That's why. oh shit. I used the wrong one. Ah, delete. You, yeah, that cool speech was about you. Go there and. Oh man, I was too freaking late. <sighs> That's your job. We. Are we winning? No, we're not. What's going on? Oh man. This is hard to look at, isn't it? Not because I'm kind of doing anything good, just because it's so laggy. I look at uh, my recording before and it didn't seem as laggy as I see it. Which is strange. It's really strange, to be honest. Okay, you hold that line. And you, what's going on here? Can you do this? Oh yeah, they can in some places. A little bit. And more Chinese troops are coming. This pocket is standing and that's using uh, what, like 50 Chinese units. Who's losing? Is it because I'm attacking? Because I shouldn't. Oh yeah, I am retreating. But once I retreat behind the river, that's a safe point. Yeah. Whatever. More ships getting sunk. I'm just singing their big boys at this point. Look at that. Look at this one. RSMG Fludo sunk it. It's HMS Royal Oak. Oh, I know this one. What's going on here? Yeah, nothing. Nobody cares at this point. The present. Finish the series. No. I'm satisfied when there is no border guard right here. When this is gone, I'm gonna be satisfied. Until then, no, I'm not. Not even close. It is kind of unsatisfying, but. I mean, there are mods that increase the lifespan of the game, like, uh, that go up to Route 56, right? There's this mode that basically increases uh, the time you can play the game up to 56 here. But then it's still laggy, I think. Or maybe it's like balancing the game out until that year so that there's not so many troops. That also could be a possibility. I can look into that. That could be useful for any later series. If I want to play more Hoi 4 in this channel. And I would kind of want to do that. It's not something that I dislike. I really like this Let's Play. And when I looked at the views, it's a lot. My channel grew about 50% when it comes to views and watch time during just this week alone. It's huge, maybe you can't see it because my channel never really broke through uh, the status of being just a little channel. But it really was something. I mean, it is something for me. Maybe it shows that I'm doing a good job or just YouTube decided to show my videos to someone. Okay, this is getting done with. Perfecto. Look at that. All greens. Now you see why I did that. How about you def defend this factory, eh? 
Yeah, thank you. Oh, they're wasting their troops on me. And my planes can go here. I mean, they're already... Many of them are here already. But look at that. Close air support. All of you. You're gonna get here. And... Yeah, this airport is gonna increase in size. And what is this? Oh, it's just... Oh, I'm, for a second I thought it was a front line. Holy shit. Okay. Do we need anti-air anywhere? No, we don't, but I could really use some more ships. To just build them faster. Just build them in Sicily and... Croatia. Albanian ships. Majestic. Majestic Albanian flotilla. Hold the line. What are you doing? Huh. Where, where is he going? Oh. Um. Panzer expert. Panzer expert time. The allies are gonna start dropping nukes soon. Oh. Speaking of nukes. Let's, let's build them. And speaking of nuclear reactors, let's build as many of them as we humanly can. In Egypt, of all places. And in Israel. I think the more of them we have, the faster we can build the nukes. You know, nukes are fun. So... I want some of them. Then I can start nuking them in Indochina. Imagine that. Italian nukes dropping in Indochina. Now that's a true Vietnam War I want. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Actual... Oh my gosh! Actual Navy of Japan is getting sunk, unlike just the convoys that were sunk before. Okay, China is still losing their manpower. Well, I think they have enough. Manpower. 26 million? Hmm. Yeah, that's enough. Oh, yeah. Aren't you doing what you're supposed to do? Well, they are, just not enough. Sinkian capitulated. Nice. Can I get some more, please? Fire this time. All the fires. Do all the good stuff. Naval strike, poor strike. They probably have their navy here. And I'm still losing in the air. Majestic. That's also really weird, but they really outnumber me when it comes to planes. I can only have 6,000 while they have tw up to 20,000, you know? Plus, when you count in the 18,000 of these guys here, I- what? Did Iceland just join the freaking Axis? Why? <laughs> it doesn't make sense, absolutely doesn't make sense. But hell yeah. Which means that the Germans are probably gonna try to protect it in some stupid way. Their navy is gonna die and so is Iceland. But I wanna see that. And oh, 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 oh. Why is this not green? Do you mean that I don't have enough ships? I do, it's almost 260. What are you talking about? And these are battleships. No one can destroy my BBs. Not a single one have sank. Kind of cool. My Italian battleships rule the waves currently. Look at that, see? A victory! <laughs> we sank the proper navy. RSMG Velela killed 
HMS Hood. And guess what? The Hood scale model is right above me on the shelf. A ship famous for being sunk by Bismarck. And now the Italians took the kill. And it's 1947, the ship is still their main navy thing? It's crazy, it's a very old one. And it also has a pretty interesting history. The HMS Hood used to be called the Mighty Hood. It traveled, uh, traveled all around the war and in between, you know, the two world wars. Uh, just to, you know, show off the might of the British Empire. And now we show them where what we think about their might by completely destroying them. As we should, as we should. Okay, the invasions are getting more annoying, but look at this huge amount of Chinese units. The invasions are nothing. And this is it just me, or did we kind of push a little bit in here, maybe? Or did they push? Borders change a bit. Take their capital. Okay, let's think, where do we want to drop the nukes? Probably this area right here, so I can get the Bengal, right? One here, one here, and one in Calcutta. They push through, they can regroup, we push them out to Dhaka. So we need like two or three nukes. The next, we need to nuke these people here. The attrition here is through the roof. Also, this place could be nuked, finally, because China never finished them off. The Guangxi clique. Oh, Mongolia is just dying. Wait, this is- is this mine? Are you actually pushing for me? I'm or- I'm actually owning part of Tibet. I mean, no, this is Tibet, so what is this? Okay, okay, more of their navy gets sunk. That just cute. Them thinking they can invade me after 20th time? Imagine did they failed 20 times. Well, that's Japan in this game. In Iran. When Iran looks like people in Iran just look out the window when they see Japanese people inv invading, they're like, ah, every other day. Pronto, it's not even special for them. This point, they may think it's cute. Alright. Mm. Almost enough of everything. Just need more tanks. And not a single ship is getting produced. Why exactly? Oh yeah, not a single ship was getting produced because I don't have enough steel. Wait a second, I didn't know that. I actually didn't know that. And in order to get more steel, we need to actually improve infrastructure in the steel making places. So that. This. Hmm. I don't have too many of them. Don't I? Yeah, I really don't. Surprised there's nothing here that's still related. Okay, hopefully that can give me something. And all of that has to be done like now. Okay, so the naval stuff needs to be cancelled. And we need to trade. I think that after we took out many nations, we can trade with Germany again. Okay, enough steel. Now we are back to building ships. I didn't know we were really so deep in the ditch. I'm sorry for that. I was kind of stagnant because of it. Uh, now I kind of feel bad. Okay, so Australia now controls this right colonial holdings yeah the malaya is theirs and australia is here surprisingly they occupy that the others are doing great this game for what they are i mean their navy is also big right yeah it's pretty nice and their air force yeah it's as big as mine basically I 
I shouldn't even consider them a lower player, you know? Or not a lower tier. I am kind of low tier currently. Because I have no way to do anything. I can just build up my fleet, you know. But what does it give me? And the Spain is losing an all place in Africa. Not surprising at all. Who would get surprised by that at this point? This is a funny situation here when from time to time I can simply push through them and it doesn't give me anything. And both of us do it a lot in here, the allies and the axis. We just constantly push into them. And they push into us. Ethiopia is the only front I consider lost. I think I won basically in uh, here in Africa, to North Africa, I won in Europe. What just happened? Am I seriously dividing Mongolia and Xinjiang? Okay, I'll, I'll take that. Can I? No, because I, I can't take Mongolia. I don't want anything. Okay. I just want this. I can't. I just want this. I can have that for some reason, but it doesn't give me nothing. I just put a pass. Can I take this now? Yeah. This? Yeah. So pass the rest. Done. Okay. The war with this Chinese thing is finished. I mean, there's some Guangxi clique, but uh, yeah, there's still Chinese in you know, the front. Number something. Oh, look at this poor allied Chinese division. It's over for them. Soon gonna be over. You know what's fun? I only have planes here, and they do enough damage for the Japanese fleet to keep them in check. I don't think they really grew that much because I'm constantly attacking them. And what is this? Oh, yeah. I think I know what's happening. Okay, I'm gonna get pushed back to see. Stupid stalemate. It's 1947. That's why. Did they just leave their freaking capital undefended? There's like nothing in it. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> I'm gonna take the capital now, it's gonna be so funny. Okay, sorry you now. You've been huge, too overpowered, but my capital is yours. You see, I did something in this episode, taking capital of Yunnan. Okay, Venezuela, send me volunteers, how about you join my freaking faction? That'd be useful. I mean, no, because if they do, they're gonna just get invaded by the US. True, true. I mean, they could hold that line for a bit. That could help the war effort. You don't capitulate because of me? Holy moly. That's amazing. Push. And now do they push? Si, signore. No, they don't. Maybe it's because I now I have equipment that's, you know, not the negative equipment and they lost plenty of their equipment. Therefore, I am able to push more than they can. That's what I think happened.
Okay, this needs to die. What is this? What's the capital of? Wait a second. Why is this not in a war of me? It's not because it has a different color of a capital. But what nation is this? This is still Yunnan that's dead and capitulated. But it still has a capital. Does it even identify as being in a war? Yeah, it does. So, what was the point of this capitulation again? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, 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 it disappeared. Did you lose something? No. Still the same size of navy. Kind of bigger. I like how when you... Before I think it was, you could just capture the ships if you want. And you took some of the ships away from the enemy. Or was it in Total Wars? I mean, in Total Wars it was for sure. I remember playing Shogun when it happened. What is this? Republic of Vietnam. Why is Republic of Vietnam fighting for me? It's a republic. Fighting for the fascist and half fascist Chinese people. That sounds hot. Okay. You're improving relationships with Oman. Oh man. There's nothing I can do for you. Sorry, I'm canceling your boost. You're useless. So I am. We're not gonna see Khmer Empire today. Sorry. Slow, boring progress. Once we hit 1948, it's over. I don't want to continue this game anymore. Because there's basically no point if this continues. If you stop, nothing can be done. But do they have to stop? Wait, wait, what is this? What is this? Is this our faction? Yes, there are did we just freaking cut them through? Holy crap, they... Is it... It's really... It's either really good for us or really bad. Push through them now. Yeah, it's really bad. Oh, man, we're gonna die. We're gonna lose so many divisions. Just watch that. Well, you know what? I'm gonna save the game. In case there is some way I can actually save myself from this... Awful, awful thing. Safe, safe, come on, come on, come on, I know it's late, yeah. Avanzate, avanzate. Whatever, don't die on me. The Chinese are... Oh, shit. Take out Hanoi. Are they actually cut out from supplies? Yes, Hanoi is gonna be nap hours. Under capitulation? Maybe. Yunnan will capitulate twice today. If the last episode was called the best episode, what do you call this one? The episode. The final episode. The final. Last time it was final in my um, name of a video, I got 2000 views. You imagine this happening again? And it's like, oh man, I finished again. Finished the series, which was getting me views. And it's like, oh, that's Kingdom of Laos. Okay, Laos. I'm just gonna cut them from supplies. Don't you mind? I like how there are Romanian tanks in Vietnam. I just love that. How are you doing, Romania? Hmm, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Hurting... Oh. Hungary's doing also pretty good, and Bulgaria, which helped me a lot in here, doesn't do so well. They have convoys, though. What, what are the Dutch doing here? Why is it by the Dutch? I don't know. 
Nice, they're completely cut off. And there's like 10 of these guys here. And they're getting no supplies. With the attrition, 50%. Push your advantage. Don't let them break. This is our only chance. We're not gonna get anything that's even close to this, I think. They better don't break us here. If we do this, attacking India from both sides here and Burma will be much easier. The supremacy shall be ours. It's hard to break a 10 division staff, which is not surprising. It's also hard to break in one division of Japanese because the attrition here is so high in the jungles. Maybe if we take care of these guys first, we make a difference. I know though. Let's just wait. Okay, another battle. I wanna, I wanna read them. I like to read them. Makes me feel good about <laughs> myself. <laughs> uh. Nationalists. Keep fighting here. Keep them busy. The more they fight there, the less allies I have to first here. Yeah, nothing can be done. But this. This is just cool. And this is our faction, right? So, currently, this is the last pocket of Chinese United Front right here. And only this piece right here. The Why is this mine? What? Excuse me? Why? Okay, push, push, push through the Vietnam. North shall win. Faster. Under. They're not even fighting. Great for us. If they're, they didn't have a huge probably fleet advantage in here, and I could have my fleet here, I could just drop in. Not a single naval invasion in this game. Pretty interesting. I, okay, there are um, outflanked. One of you goes here and takes their factories. New naval battle results. This time Japan is also here. Going back to there. What's going on, what's going on? Come on, come on, come on. Come on. The Dutch are trying to go back here to protect their factories and airports. Too bad. It's useless. Push, come on, faster. Faster. Take your factory. We need it. We need all of them. What about here? The Chinese are trying their stupid attacks and wasting your manpower. And it shows that they're, you know, red is everywhere, but it's only just Chinese and their stupid attacks. Just make my paddles better, like here when we just crush them. Occupy Bangladesh. Another naval battle. This time another big Japanese ship. Crater type Ma Maya. Okay, Maya is gone. Crop rain. Ah, ah, ah. Now. Punch them through here. really need to kind of stabilize in here. I don't really have many tanks under my hand to just, you know, outflank them again. Stabilize the front. Here, take Daka.
they don't have supplies because this is their capital so they have more or less supplies here right maybe another battle this time nothing special Wait, this is just now annoying but we are down with this pocket finally and so be nice to just use it. okay these guys all of them are here so let's all divide the orders this this and this will be all separate for now this guy you will take care of this front not this one only this one you you take care of this front and you you also take care of this front do what you're supposed to. There's no one here. This way will take less attrition and now all of our efforts are divided equally. I am losing here when it comes to the planes. Not a big deal. I can easily add some fires. They're really not the best fires, you know, in the world. But that may be just enough. Because I don't think there's enough airports for them to even place them place enough placement here and we are winning here totally come on come on come on why aren't you fighting are you not deployed yet fully yet are they now yes we're still losing what about here can I add something now this is not ours whatever we won't get any air supremacy here could be much worse. Push. Push. Left open. Push where you can. Push everywhere. Pin and get out. Contain them and take Dhaka. When we take Dhaka, we move. Uh, we create a garnison, move all our army here, and create destroy this southern India thing. Which I think it's actually a pocket. What can they do from there? It's like a, our soft underbelly, which is the best for like a soft underbelly ever. And your job will be actually to break through. You understand what a breakthrough is, right? Force this attack. Who cares if you get 50% attrition? 50% <laughs> attrition is nothing! Because I said so. And that guy's ours, oh, holy shit. Great. And yeah, that's too much attrition. How about half of you move to help this guy? No, no, no. I said half of you. Yeah, help this boy out. And you, you need a new trade, right? Become adaptable. An infantry expert. Did we really just... Oh yeah, we did. Thanks, Portugal. Very cool. Encirclement. There's more happening in this episode in this episode than I thought it would. What a nice surprise. Did the front just change? I think it did, but take it back then. Let's start with this thing. Okay, Dominion of India. Now you will be you will capitulate again, but this time you will capitulate properly without any stupidity involved. I hope. They don't have ships here. Good. And I'm still losing when it comes to my planes. Which is just offensive at this point, I should be winning. Maybe it's because of here, right? That should be it. 
I don't have enough planes to give it here. Just like 30 is what I have. Whatever you can do. Whatever you can do. Giovanni got wounded. Because why wouldn't he? No, no, no. Oh shit, there's so many of them. There's no point of even being here. You. Yeah, all of you. Scratch that. Scratch also all of that. You all will get to this front line, and your mission is to finish in the off. Yep, exactly. Much better. And. Is that, am I in negative equipment or positive equipment? I'm pretty much in the positive, right? Yeah, I'm good. New naval battle. Nothing, nothing. Since I'm in the positive... I think we can finally push here. Okay, new orders. We're gonna have to push through the river, so it's gonna be hard. I know, I know. You'll try to gain land up to this river this time. Go. Can you? No, I can't. You're not doing that. I'll just do it manually. First take this place. There is a port there, so it gives them supply. You plunge through there. Ships, nothing really. And China is about to take the leadership. Which means I just need more factories. Shit. For that I need to take India and it doesn't really go to me, it go it all goes to China, damn it. It will only go to me if I push them directly from this direction, not this one. But this is also good for me. You see they're cut out. Oh man. You lose something, you win something. China will probably be the ruler of the Roman Empire. The wet dreams of alternate historians, maybe. Who knows? There are weird old history fans out there, right? I mean, they may be watching me, considering what I'm actually, what my channel has been about this time. I mean, have you seen map review? <laughs> yeah, after you're done with this series, check out my map review. I am actually reviewed the map of this game, which I think gives some pretty interesting insights of what I think about it. And it's my main series now. And I'm proud of it, although nobody watches it and nobody asks for it. Yeah, once I left, they have supplies and they can push. You see, sometimes it's not about the numbers. Sometimes it's about <laughs> leaving space for the Chinese because they have more people and they can lose them. That's a quote somebody can live by, you know? Just let Chinese handle it, there's more of them. Both of you, storm up to there. Yeah. Look at that. This place needs to be Carnism, by the way. Who wants to do that? Of course you do! Okay, since you really want to garnish in this place, this is what you're supposed to protect. Yay. Go. The rest can pretty much handle it. Right? Yeah. 
it's over. I think they're actually retreating and turning, taking their army out of here. Probably somewhere to uh, the Dutch uh, East India. 91% towards getting overtaken by China. What do they actually lack? They lack like 200 factories. They can't get that fast, can't they? They have 88 civilians and I have 90. Yeah, they won't get them that fast if I just build factories soon. Wait, what? Why are we losing here? Yeah, because we're just like the last big pockets. That's why. Kind of makes sense. None of my guys are here. Okay, so I'm pushing. I am actually pushing everywhere, right? Because I did move south. In the good, good meaning of the word. 11 cruisers. This hurts them. I need. I think it really hurts them. Germany, are you ready? Aye, aye, Captain. I can't hear you. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> okay, okay, let's do this thing. We're gonna go into the British Channel. Let's just save the game before this happens, because this may be the worst thing we ever did. Hey, boys. Boys, I'm talking to you. Yeah. <laughs> we just left this place unprotected. Oh no. Okay, there's already American fleet in here. Let's just wait for the shit show to start. And let's give some more planes that can protect my channel. Actually, no, we'll let them come in. If they come in, I'm just gonna cut them, bring back my fleet, and I have. Everything here is garnisoned. I can open another front. They can't. Okay, so I'm fighting with the Japanese currently. And I destroyed half of their fleet. Holy moly. Perfect. Another one. And we just sunk Yamado. No, it's Nagado. But they're the proudest ship of the Navy. Okay, I'm finally ready to actually fight them. And the Germans are spending too many troops actually putting them here and thinking they can do anything. Come on, invade England now since you are able to. You can actually do that. They don't have even many troops. Speaking of it, I can do that. I can invade England. I can Barbarossa them. I could do it. Okay, plan. Since this is done for, we charge India. After we charge India, we take the Britain. Another victory is the Yamato. No, Haruna. I want to sing the Yamato. The Japanese fleet is also here and they're just leading convoys. Come on, come on, come on. Get taken. We're getting 50% attrition. Come on, come on, come on. What even is this place? Why are they defending so well? Another battle, which we won. We're losing no ships. It's because we probably have a really great composition. And yes, Operation Sea Lion happened. Thank Germany. Very cool. Another battle, which we won, and we sank HMS Eagle. Didn't actually sank? Like, somewhere here? Was this? I don't know. Okay, there's plenty of Germans. They attacked in both places. They have Dover and Norwich. They have two ports. Okay, they're pushing through, they're pushing through, they're going around London. Okay, no, they lost it over. They're gonna die here. Yeah, they are, but Norwich is still holding. There's more and more troops, as you can see here, they're coming. If they take London now. Oh, crap. The US is here. But I need to hold it as long as I can, I have no choice. Please, Spain, keep them here. Since my navy is not here, they, j they can finally land. But this is more important. If we take out England, this whole thing may die, and they... No. It won't, but they have less supply, I can just push through finally, and Ethiopia will be mine. Look at that, National Spain is actually winning in Africa. We may win this game today. We may be victorious. 
all of you. So you have nothing better to do. How about this guy does what he's supposed to do. And this guy becomes one with this army. When you become one with this army, scratch your old order, delete it, scrap it, and scratch. <laughs> scratch me in the order, please. Go here. It's time to retake Southern India. You become uh, one of this guy. And are you taking, taking care of everything? Yeah, yeah there are. Okay, they are garnishing this this thing. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, I'm the king of this place. London is about to fall. I think. Yeah, London's about to fall. London's surrounded in two in three provinces around it are German. There's only one left that's not. No, actually two left. They're not English. They're surrounding London. The Germans are pushing. More and more units are arriving. More and more, as you can see. They're taking the defenses. They're trying to take London. But they're unsuccessful. And Spain pushed the guys, but the bad guys. The Americans. <laughs> Although they shouldn't call the bad guys out. Who's having the fleet supremacy here? Of course, we don't. What did I think for a second? I thought that China built a massive Chinese fleet. Okay, okay. Sea Lion is still going on. There is a shit ton of German units in here, but nobody is winning. Maybe if I use my planes. No, the planes are already winning here. Holy moly, one. It's 948, but I haven't done the game yet. I don't want to. Their fleet is sinking. Their fleet is in basically status of total destruction. They lost so many battleships. These guys lost so many ships. America lost so many battleships. Their fleet is actually smaller than mine. Perfect. Germany has a huge fleet. What about these guys? They still have something. I wish I could see it though. They probably have battleship too. Okay. Bye bye London. It's been cool fighting with you. But... Yep. The fall of London. We didn't even need the nukes. Perfect. This is just beautiful. Of course, you probably think that the, this episode is too long, right? Yeah, it is. So I'm just gonna kind of end it here in the best, in the worst way I could because you probably want to see the end. But the last episode will not be this one, it'll be the next one. Okay, so see you guys in the next episode when we see if England capitulates and if I will be the master of the Roman Empire, as the way as it should be. Okay, see you guys. Bye.